a woman who was once lost, actually once lost her right to vote, now is making sure that others get to the polls. Pete Zavakis explains how she's doing it and the motivation behind that effort. Data from the state shows turnout in Milwaukee typically takes a dip in midterm elections. Tequila Burris wants to change that. Have you guys voted yet? Yeah. Yes. The 28-year-old MATC student does voter outreach on campus and gives nonpartisan presentations to classes like this one about the importance of getting to the ballot box. She's a convicted felon who only got the right to vote back after completing probation. Is one of the reasons you're so passionate because you had that right taken away for a while? Uh, yeah, you could say that. So now she urges others to exercise that right at the polling place right here on campus. We're excited to work with the city to help more students vote. Turnout in Wisconsin has been generally strong in recent elections. More than 67% of the voting age population in 2016. 54.8% in the 2014 midterms and higher than 70% in 2012. In Milwaukee specifically, turnout trends slightly lower. 56.2% in 2016, 47.5% in 2014, and almost 66% in 2012. Burris thinks Milwaukee can do better. That's the reason for her work. We should have 100%, you know, because everybody should pay attention to what's going on around them. In its first full week open, which was last week, that polling place at MATC tallied 368 early votes.